Harvested in the mountains, we grated you into fine granules, added water, and you worked miracles. Oh, what joy you brought into my life. Freedom I never knew. I grew up in Sigisiki in the Eastern Cape. When they describe it, they say it's a one-street town. Though it never felt that way when I was growing up. It was my world. It was bigger than that. I used to run around wearing my traditional attire. And of course, my granny would shout at me, Zemkita, come back! Why don't you have Isunuka on? Whether you're going to fetch water, whether you're going to fetch wood, you had to have Isunuka on or granny would shout. It was all I needed. So much freedom. I remember the brides used to apply it on the morning of their weddings. The pimpled teenagers aggressively plastered it on top of their faces. And of course the toddlers were caught with stains of Isunuga all over them. Their butt cheeks, their hair. I can't tell you how many memories I have of you. A pride of my people's medicinal knowledge. all changed. I was moving to the city and I realized there was no place for me. There was no place for my traditional attire and there was no place for my isunuka. I let you go. It was my own cowardice that deceived me. The city didn't have a place for you or did it. Fitting in was my choice. It was my purchase. And now, this all sounds like a dream. Distant. A hazy memory. A past I still am in love with. <laughs> 